What's going on guys? Today we're reviewing the Titan Returns Power Master Optimus Prime um, that I just got. I know this is a little bit late, but you know I just got this one. Uh, here's the box. We'll go through the box here. Um, cool design. Um, he's got three modes. Okay, so that's his robot mode right there. He's got his vehicle mode and then you got your base mode slash city mode down here. Pretty awesome. Um, now with these Titans return lines, you come with a Headmaster, which you come with uh, Apex, Apex right here, uh, which is molded very closely uh, to Orion Pax, uh, which basically goes underneath uh, his little mask here. Um, that's the box. No, nothing really new here. Cool looking design there. All right, let's get into the figure. But with the box, get your instructions. Don't need them. And you get your little collector card. Comes with like awesome little stats for Optimus Prime. Pretty awesome. All right. Now his vehicle mode um, is, is pretty good. He's uh, pretty good. The paint details on here are pretty awesome. Um, I like the blue. The red's pretty nice. However, th the color on the trailer, I don't really like the color on the trailer. Um, it's very, as I skin tone, skin tone, so gray. Just that base plastic color, uh, which is not too, you know, um, too good for me anyway. Um, you got little molded in details, like the door, the panel work here, which is pretty good. Uh, the nice Autobot symbol here that comes on both sides. Alright, more molded detail here on the side. In the back. Alright, the front cab, which uh, this has been remolded from the Ultra Magnus mold, but it, this is heavily remolded. Um, they use some pieces from Ultra Magnus, but not a lot. Okay, wheels, all the wheels spin, they're all plastic, um, not much, well there is detail in the wheels here as you can probably see, but there's not painted in detail, so if you're a customizer, you know, you go in there, put some silver paint on there, no problems. Um, as for labels go, uh, you know, these are just pre-printed labels um, that they've put on here. Um, I'm pretty sure Rep Repro Labels will be putting out a set for this um, sometime soon. But um, yeah, overall, it is a good, good model in vehicle mode. It does go back and forth. Pretty amazing. The cab has full motion in and around. Um, so this is the leader class figure. We'll just compare it to the Voyager uh, Optimus Prime from the Combiner War series. It's the size difference. What would have been awesome is if the Power Up Optimus Prime or Power Master Optimus Prime was the same size as uh, the Voyager, the cab wise, um, and then the additional trailer it would be a huge figure, uh, which would be amazing. All right, uh, we'll get to transforming Power Up Optimus Prime uh, into his base mode. Uh, so firstly, take off his guns, don't really need them, we will flick these little panels out, they come to the side, they're just on a, on a, uh, on a couple pegs. Uh, with the arms, just fold these back all the way up. All right, we'll separate, separate the arms, flip them down, peg them into the side, flip these up. So you got that. We'll also flip his center chest piece up. So you have the 
vehicle like that. Um, underneath the front cab, you got this little peg. So flick that down. You can either you can either swivel it around or you can push it in. Up to you. Okay. So then we're going to separate these. I'm going to flick and turn the feet around so they're flat. I'm going to spin the legs inward. Separate the legs. Put the trailer parts down. And just angle the knees. Have your guns. Yeah. Okay, anyway, I had to pause the video shortly, but um, there you have it. Uh, it was complete when I transformed it. So uh, here is the base mode. Uh, I just attached the guns into the side here, as you can probably see. Um, these can lift out and you can you know flip them around and they're basically for Apex or any other of the Headmaster figures that come out in the Titan Wars series or Titan Return series okay so we'll just get into Apex right here All right little figure and he serves as Optimus Prime's head uh, articulation wise you got a spin you got a rotation on the head not much but you do uh, rotation at the shoulders right, up and down and the legs um, no split legs just normal legs um, and you put those down flip those up and flip them around and you have his Orion Pax-esque head that uh, goes underneath his mask. Okay, so we're going to transform um, city mode into robot mode. We'll transform Optimus Prime, or we'll power up Optimus Prime. So here we go, we'll just take these off for the time being. We'll rotate the legs, put this section in, put the foot and around and then we put this section in all right and there's pegs on each side so they'll clip in just move the foot forward there we go do the same to the other side push the foot forward clip it in with the arms, just rotate your arms down, like so. The back, you're gonna wanna flip the cab up a little bit, rotate him around, and push it down. All right, so you get the chest. You want to open up the chest where it shows you his head fold this little section down now pop up Prime's head right. close the roll up and you're going to want to flip this section all the way up and when he's like that I'm going to turn the legs down and clip the chest piece up. There you have it. It's Power Up Optimus Prime. Stand up, stand up, stand up. 
as you probably see, he has no, he has no eyes. No eyes. That's because we haven't put uh, Apex in right here. So you're just going to flip her up. Take little Ryan Packs Apex. All right. I'm going to put clip him into the little socket here. If you can get in for me. There we go. And uh, you're going to flip his head the mask over the top of his head. There you go. As you can see here, he's got eyes now. Um, articulation wise, we'll zoom the camera out a little bit. Alright, articulation wise, he's got a ratchet for a shoulder, a ratchet for a mid shoulder um, and he's got a twist, a bicep twist uh, for his hands he's got this, um, they've done away with the uh, ape hands that uh, the Combiner Wars Optimus Prime had um, he's got just a, a grip that you can move in and out um, no wrist twist at all Uh, he's got that head movement, um, no waist swivel at all. Um, he's got a mid thigh pivot here. He's got a ratchet hip, back forward, left right. Um, he's got a knee ratchet, and he's got. Uh, he hasn't got a toe, and he hasn't really got an ankle. The ankle just moves, you know, back and forward like that. So, uh, posability wise, you, you always have him in, you would always have him in like a, a sort of like A, a pose, A, a esque pose or something like that. So, there he is. Um, as for weapons, you know, you can get your uh, the little weapons that came on his truck and you can put them on the side here uh, if you like. Alright, like so, or like so, however you want them. Now you can go up, up, down, side, whatever, um, which is pretty cool. Um, weapons that he does come with, uh, just base, standard black weapons. Yeah, um, just have a, a mold. Um, they look like they go together. All right, for when when he holds it when he holds it up now getting him to hold these weapons is a pretty bad way of doing it basically there is a peg slot in here probably see that one right there so really you want to fit in the weapon and just close his hands around it so you'll peg it in and then close it up and then that's him holding it. Oh, stand up. It's pretty heavy this one. So overall, uh, he's a good figure. I picked him up for um, $79.99. Um, this is from Target. Um, Target was having a special. Everywhere else is uh, $89.99. Um, pick it up, you know, anywhere from uh, Target, Toys R Us, um, you know, Myers. Um, any real toy store will basically stock them now because it's been out for about two months. Um, the, there will be a Takara release of these very, sometime soon and um, it, again it'll be remolded again um, uh, the chest will be different uh, as 
as for paint apps go, look, it's it's actually very close to the Power Up uh, Optimus Prime from G1. The hands are red. Um, <laughs> it's a good remold. I, I really do like it. Um, so if you want to pick one up, just head down to your local toy store. They should have it right now. Um, please comment, like, and subscribe, and uh, I'll put some more reviews up. Thanks for watching.